Hi, this is Dr. Watson with Spinal Facts. Today we're going to talk about the importance of spinal integrity. In another segment, we're going to talk about deviations left to right, which would be a scoliosis or a curvature, ideally straight, but more, I focus in our office more on the problem with flexion distortion of the head and trunk. So ideally, we like to have four curves in the body that are symmetrical, that are over top each other, all right? So we have a cervical curve that has a lordosis. We have a kyphosis, which is in the thoracic uh, spine, which curves to the back. We have a matching lumbar with the cervical spine, a lordosis, and in the sacrum, another kyphosis that should match with the thoracic spine. Now, nature puts these into our spine because it makes it very strong, just like an arch. Uh, in architecture and history, we found they could really build higher if they made an arch, it made things stronger. The spine is no different. So the biggest thing we see is people's posture going forward, the flexion distortion. As you see, when you start to go forward, these curves are lost. The lumbar curve flattens out the thoracic spine. The problem with that is the body says, hey, we got to stop this. And the only way it can do that is lock joints and make spasmodic uh, regions of the uh, muscles that become hard and have trigger points and they burn. It can affect all the way from the TMJ, headaches, neck pain between shoulders, hips, and even as you stand forward, it affects every joint and balance in the whole body from the ankles to the knees. So ideally, we like to get the body back up. Now, what we do in our office is, if people just try to stand up, I've had people, they're locked. So with chiropractic, we try to open the spinal segments. Each segment should you move individually. Instead of the whole area being locked, I do, people look around like this, they're locked, okay? You should have good range of motion individually. So many times with chiropractic manipulation and adjustment, when we get areas to move and we bring the body back up, as you watch and see, the curvatures come back. Now the muscles that tend to be most affected are the ones that were run beside the spine called the para or beside the spine muscles. From all the way up to occiput, all the way that run beside the spine, all the way to sacrum. They can create a lot of pain. Many times just touching them tells you that they're spasmodic and they're trying to do the work of uh, the integrity of the spine because the brain is very intelligent uh, in uh, the human body, so it tries to do things to help us compensate. The problem is this compensatory uh, reaction to the body creates pain. So when we recognize this, when we bring the curves back, and many times with chiropractic movement, manipulation, we get the thoracic spine, the integrity comes back. Uh, we'll talk in another segment about one of the biggest issues is sleeping curled. And many times when you sleep curled, uh, you take that six to eight hours a day times a week, a month, five, ten years, the body will lose its shape. And it's important to get that back up, otherwise premature degeneration uh, is uh, 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 very common with almost everyone that we see that comes into our office. So uh, the spinal fact is very important. I hope this was informative and uh, thanks for watching.